Hi everyone! Hello! Today I wanted to quickly talk about nursing clothes. This is something I kind of rebelled against getting for quite a while. I don't know why it took me so long to actually break down and get some proper nursing clothes. Now that I've done it, six months later, I'm just kicking myself for not having done it the second I started breastfeeding or at least a month after I started doing it. If you're nursing or you're planning on nursing your baby, buy nursing clothing. I have always had a nursing bra, that's the only thing. And I'm going to show you a couple of different things that I have and that I've been using. So the first nursing bra that I had bought was this nursing bra. It's from Cake. Here it is. I really like it because it's very soft, it's very stretchy, so depending if your size does change, the bra is still going to fit you. This isn't a review on the bra. I do love this bra, however. I can also wear it as a sports bra. For me, it has enough support, so if I am working out at home, which I do, and Emmeline decides, hey ma, it's time to eat, I'm fine. It's much easier than an actual sports bra. I know a lot of nursing clothing, it doubles as maternity wear, and I think it's definitely like that to save women money because you already have to buy new clothes because you've got this huge stomach and then after the baby's born if you are gonna nurse what a pain to have to go buy more clothes I get the concept but for me I did not wear any of my maternity clothes as nursing clothes after a couple weeks a couple reasons for that is I feel like it's too much fabric there was so much going on. I, you might ask, what were you doing before you had nursing clothes? I will explain. Fortunately for me, I don't have really large breasts. And I didn't want to buy the nursing tank tops because again, that would have been more clothing. Not only do I have a t-shirt on, but then I have a tank top underneath it and then a nursing bra because I didn't want to be lifting up my shirt to feed Emmeline, I was using some of my old clothes, and have my stomach exposed because I think it's a little awkward for me. So I used to just buy a tank top or a cami with a built-in bra. And that was enough support for me so I could just slip this on underneath my regular clothes and when I wanted to feed Emmeline I would just pull the top down. I still do that. I definitely recommend that. I was just using t-shirts, but it's just been getting so irritating and annoying to feed Emmeline. It's, I get her ready and she knows she's gonna eat and it's taking me forever and she's getting annoyed. So I decided to finally invest in a really nice nursing top. This is Boob. The brand is Swedish. It's made in Europe. It's really good quality and I've heard nothing but good things about it and I've had nothing but good experiences with it. So I definitely recommend it. And if you do have the money and money is not an option, I would buy all my nursing clothes from them. <laughs> so it's just your regular t-shirt, but it folds up here so you can nurse this way. So here's our t-shirt, I'm wearing it, and you just lift up and pull down this little piece and you can feed your baby. It's really modest, actually. People don't even notice that I'm nursing Emmeline when I have it. They think maybe I'm just holding her. So if modesty is something that you're concerned about, this is definitely a good purchase. I will say it is sized for an adult female. This is a small and it, it's a little big on me. It is a little bit on the expensive side. That being said, for me it's worth it because I plan to breastfeed Emmeline for at least a year. If you're only going to breastfeed for a few months, if you're not going to breastfeed at all, obviously it's not worth it. But if you're planning on breastfeeding for a year or beyond that, I would definitely recommend spending the money, splurging a little bit, and investing in some really good quality nursing clothes that don't make you feel frumpy. The weather's changing and it's getting a little bit colder. What I have been doing is 
with sweatshirts for Feeding Emmeline is I just have button-up sweatshirts or zip-up sweatshirts. And it's been fine, but I wanted something different because I wanted something that was closed. I got two nursing sweatshirts. This one, I apologize, they're a little wet. It's quite long. It's actually from Poland. I got it on eBay. But it has zippers right here. So, boom, there you go. And this is the best, in my opinion, for feeding Emmeline. There's no fumbling with anything. There's nothing for her to get her fingers entangled in. I absolutely love it. It's really long, and if it's too long, I just fold up the inside. You may ask, oh, well, what do you, you unzip it, and then you're just supposed to, what if you have a regular t-shirt on? Well, I just kind of lift up my shirt underneath, unzip, feed baby, and it works really well. The second nursing sweatshirt that I got, again, it's also a hoodie, and this is what it looks like. Again, it's really quite long, which is nice, quite long. It does go past my butt if I put it on. I don't really like that always, so I tuck it up, but if I have some leggings on because because I'm going to work out and I'm going for a walk, it's perfect. There's two zippers here, and they unzip all the way down. Boom. <laughs> so. If you, obviously you wouldn't unzip the whole thing if you're gonna feed your baby. You can just go ahead and unzip one side and feed the baby that way. What I like about this is if I have a woven wrap or a soft carrier on, I can carry Emmeline with this over it. I just unzip here and she sits right there. And I got a size that was big enough for me to do that. So it's a little bit baggy on me. These can also be worn while you're pregnant as well so they have space but I can literally put this on over the both of us and then we can walk around and both of us can be warm in the, the sweatshirt, which I really like. This is super soft. This is my favorite one because it's so soft inside. It's, it's amazing, I love it. So those are my, my hoodies. I do want to get the boob one, but I don't have it yet. <laughs> Final piece of nursing clothing that I wanted to mention are my nursing necklaces. You can see I have one on here. Um, and there's their teething necklaces. I got two different kinds. One that's really colorful and rainbow. And then a plain wooden one with a small flower. I love these. You do need to check it before you let your baby chew on it. I basically wear it and Emmeline plays with this instead of my hair or my clothing. Don't leave your children alone with a teething necklace. I think that's easy enough said. Um, but if you have it around your neck, there's many different kinds of them. I really recommend it if you're having a lot of problems with your baby grabbing your hair or grabbing your lips or your face. Emmeline is really into putting her hand on my face when she's eating or when she's with me for that matter. She likes that. But these are a great buy. I've seen lots of mums have them. I got them on Etsy. Support small business. <laughs> Love them. If you have any favorite nursing clothes, be sure to comment below, share your knowledge. Thanks everyone, have a wonderful day, and I will post another video for you soon. Bye. Need some coffee. I've been talking for way too long. <laughs>